Hello and welcome to another episode of What's Inside. Star Wars Imperial Assault Week continues with another ally pack. This one is Wookiee Warriors. And who doesn't love some big uh, friendly dog guys with swords? Uh, inside here we have two plastic figures, one rule sheet, three deployment cards, one side mission card, four command cards, two skirmish mission cards, four ID tokens, 12 ID stickers. You only need the Imperial Assault core game to, to use these guys. None of their missions use any of the other tiles. So let's dig right into this. Uh, this is another part of my buddy Wyatt's uh, cool toy haul of Imperial Assault stuff. So uh, I thank him for letting me open all these. And let's see what we got here. Don't use scissors without permission from a responsible adult. And try not to cut yourself on the sharp plastic that results when you cut these. I don't like to use a mat knife on these because um, it'd be easy to cut into the paper and um, I don't want to accidentally damage my cards so I'm not going to do it to somebody else's cards either alright this is put out by Fantasy Flight in association with Disney and Fantasy Flight almost always has awesome stuff so I haven't been disappointed with any of the Imperial Assault stuff yet it's all been pretty awesome and, and the minis are really nice too. Uh, the Rancor Beast from the Jabba's, uh, Jabba's Realm expansion was really cool. And uh, so far these other ones have been pretty fantastic. So let's look at the minis first like usual. These are a little harder to get out of than these single player packs because the plastic is a little, um, it's a little more snug on these. So let's see what we got here. All right, they're the same sculpt. Um, oh, they're really nice though. They're, there's a lot of detailing on the fur. So I'm, I'm real happy with that. These are really cool looking figures, they're very detailed. I'd be a little concerned that the sword might break, but it's a lot thicker than like the lightsabers on a lot of the other ones. So they're, they're really detailed, a lot of fur. So it was probably fairly easy to actually sculpt, but it still looks really cool. It would have been nice if there was some variation between the two figures so they had some distinctness to them, like different positioning or something, but I'm not going to nitpick. Uh, they're still pretty cool looking. So let's get them out of the way and look at the inserts. Alright, first we've got some stickers here. These are all numbered 11. And then there's some uh, little card tokens here, all numbered 11. Uh, there's four of them. They're pretty nice, nice and thick card card stock. Kind of surprised because usually the these when I've seen these Wookiee at, Warriors, um, they're usually a little cheaper than some of the others, and I would think this would kick up the price like fifty cents or something, but apparently not. All right, so the paper insert is the usual insert. Pretty decent quality paper, real nice actually. It's got the contents up in the corner here. And then you go down and it's got um, a little skirmish map mission. And it just uses stuff out of the core box, like I said. So that's pretty cool. There's uh, apparently a droid prototype and weapon po prototype on here. On the other side, we have the brute force side mission. Pretty decent sized map. All the tiles are from the core box again. And everything you need's on here, of course. So we'll get that out of the way. Let's look at the cards. As usual, when taking the cards out, I always try and be a little careful because it's really easy to scratch the sides of the cards on these uh, seal of the vac, uh, the uh, Ziploc baggie. All right, so we got four different types of cards. Let's take a look at the command cards first, since there's a bunch of them. We have uh, Parting Blow. Brawler, two, interrupt when a hostile figure exits an adjacent space. Before that figure moves, perform an attack targeting that figure. Then you become stunned. And there's another parting blow. Wild Fury, creature or Wookiee, two. Used during your activation, you become focused and may perform multiple attacks during this activation. At the end of your activation, becoming stunned and bleeding. 
Well, that's a harsh trade-off. Improvised weapons, any figure, zero. Deplete, perform a blaster attack using one green and one yellow die. Uh, you cannot use abilities during this attack. <laughs> You're just throwing junk at people. That's awesome. All right, let's look at the uh, side mission card. Oh, the art's pretty nice. Brute Force, Kashik, Wilderness Facility, Side Mission, Brute Force, Wookiee Warriors Pack, Reward, Wookiee Warrior Ally. Right, that's pretty cool. All right, let's look at the uh, skirmish cards. A, the Art of Robotics Development Facility. End of each round, for each terminal he controls, each player may choose one droid prototype and move it up to four spaces. Then each player who controls at least one droid prototype gains eight VPs. B. Experimental Weapons Development Facility. A figure can retrieve a weapon prototype. A figure can only carry one weapon prototype. A figure carrying a weapon prototype applies negative one defense to its defense results and gains the following. Deplete. Perform an attack. Before performing the attack, you become focused. Uh, deplete, deplete, gain three VPs, deplete, deplete, move up to four spaces and recover three damage. That's kind of handy. All right, let's look at the character cards here. We have, uh, Fury of Kashak. I'm sure I'm butchering that word. Skirmish upgrade, two points. Attachment, Wookiee only. After an attack, targeting a figure in this group is resolved. If that figure suffered three or more damage, it becomes focused. Alright, Wookiee Warrior, red card, 11-6, uh, Brawler Wookiee, Surge, plus 2 damage, Surge Bleed, Surge Cleave, 2 damage, Fury, while attacking, if you have suffered 5 or more damage, apply plus 1 Surge to the attack results, Health of 13, Speed 4, Defense of 1 Black Die, Attack Melee, 1 Red, 1 Green, Wookie Warrior, gray card. 8 slash 4, Brawler Wookie. Surge plus 1 damage. Surge bleed. Surge cleave 2 damage. Fury while attacking. If you have suffered 5 or more damage, apply plus 1 surge to the surge results. Health of 11, speed 4, defense 1 black die. Attack melee 1 red, 1 green. So Wookiees look pretty tough. Um, haven't had a chance to play this game yet, and I'm really looking forward to it, because it looks like there's a lot of really cool stuff. And the Wookiees look like a good addition to the Alliance. But that is what is inside the Wookiee Warriors Ally Pack for Star Wars Imperial Assault. And that'll do it for this episode. Thanks again to Wyatt for letting me open all his cool stuff. And, um, be sure and tune back in, because, uh, Imperial Assault Week continues. Uh, with the next episode, we should have another Alliance pack. In the meantime, that'll do it for this episode. As always, thanks for watching, and we hope to see you next time on What's Inside.